All right, we're watching another Monkey Moon POV. Of course we are. He is the best player in the game in my eyes, and he's actually wearing the G2 away decal. So pretty much what JNAP wears on his Fennec, and uh, he's actually rocking that on his Octane along with the Gold Rush boost, of course, and the Goldstone wheels, which I never knew Monkey Moon had. I literally never knew that, but he, he should wear those more. I think those wheels look absolutely disgusting. Uh, that this car is very clean it just says hey i'm rich i'm a pro and i'm better than you that's literally what this car says to me hunter boost all the way back though here to collect this ball gets it over uh scrub 50s alpha and then now he's just gonna hit it around scrub see if teammate can do anything with this ball he does monkey's got a hundred boost this is looking very good it is a goal great positioning monkey only needed to use less than 40 boost for that he still had 60 in the tank at the end of that shot how inspirational is all of that 1-0 for the boys in blue. Keto doing a great job in this lobby. Uh, Alpha 54 and Scrub are obviously probably the favorited players here, seeing how they're both professional players. But Monkey is also a pro, and not only is he a pro, he is ranked number one on the twos leaderboard, which is pretty much why we're watching him. Uh, not well, obviously, I think he's the best player, but he is number one on the leaderboards as of right now. It's between him and Beast Mode usually the past, like, couple weeks i would say I, I think my last video was literally like beast mode the new best player in the world who knows maybe i'll title it monkey Moon is the new best player in the world but it's it's like na is is probably beast mode these days or first killer and then in eu it's like i i think it's always gonna be monkey he's just so good in every playlist his consistency is out of this world he, he doesn't do he doesn't have like a disruptor play style he just has a solid play style he's like yeah, he's just so good man so consistent and in a game like rocket league consistency is key you need to be able to do these things five minutes a game, multiple games, multiple series, etc. That's just going to be a goal. Oh my lord. How does he do it? I'll never know. All right. He brings it up. Flips into the ball late over one. 50s alpha. And that's it. That's it. That's great car control. He makes it look so simple. I can't believe that's a goal, but it is. And that's why, uh, that's why he's a great player and I'm not. Monkey's going to go for the pinch, but gets denied. He's going to pass it over to Keto. Scrub might be there first. Keto does get the 50. 50's alpha. Monkey up very early to shut this shit down. Good for him. And gets it around Scrub. This should be another goal. Actually, it's not. I thought teammate was going to be there for the follow-up very quickly, but he wasn't. Alpha could have an opportunity here. If, if Alpha went for the double tap, that could have been like very dangerous, but I don't know his boost uh, management, how much he had right there. So maybe that's why he went for the shot. The pass could have been a little too far in front of him, etc., etc. But it's still 2-0, and Orange team is... It's very difficult for them to score right now, to say the least. Uh, Yeah, Monkey rotating back foot. Ooh, look at that block from him, though. That was so sketchy, but Monkey just kept floating there and floating and floating. Alpha finally hits it. Speaking of hits it, he's going to stay and hit this ball. Monkey just fakes it and waits, though. He's going to probably score this, too. Oh, that's just in. Oh, scrub killer, mate. What are you doing? I, I, that was a great shot by Monkey. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. Very quick read. Puts it on net. You know, that that is a good shot. I'm going to pause this and say that's a good shot. Scrub was back post, yes. But Monkey put it in, like, the one spot behind him where it made it awkward. That's kind of why, it, like, Scrub looked a little fucking, like, burger right there. He looked like uh, he didn't know how to play the game. But it was because Monkey put the ball behind him. It was a good shot. It was well placed. It didn't have a lot of speed on it, but you got to think uh, Scrub should be able to save that or maybe get help from Alpha. I don't know. Didn't watch like the whole thing very closely, but uh, yeah, Monkey really, really balling out this game. 3-0. Batman goal explosion going absolutely absurd. Alpha going to pop this one up. Monkey just fake child backs up. Let's teammate goes. He's behind teammate. See how he handles this. He pinches it. Oh my Lord. That was almost just in. That would have been insane. Uh, he's going to get the touch here. Nice. Teammate, huge follow-up from Keto. Scrub is getting absolutely cooked this game. Alpha is not very happy. He's like, what are you doing? Uh, that is going to be the forfeit, actually. That's why That's why Alpha was AFK right there. Um, final stash sheet. Boy, they had... Look at the shots, man. Monkey Moon, the efficiency, 3 for 4. And, you know, some of those should have been denied, probably. They went 4 for 5 overall shooting, while the other team went 0 oh, for seven and uh yeah that, that's just i mean better shooting percentages that's four oh quick one 
that's going to be all for this game. And uh, let's hop into another one. That's only five minutes. Let's keep going. Alrighty, this one's much more recent. Uh, it's Monkey and Phaeton. Pretty sure that's how you say that from uh, Hunter Hunter. Phaeton, Phaeton. And they have P7LM, which is a Middle Eastern player, I believe, in Rico, which I don't recognize. So we'll see how this one goes. Uh, this could be like a lower ranked lobby in terms of ELO. It's already going to be 1-1 off of two kickoff goals. Sorry if I kind of missed that, but I assure you it's nothing crazy. Just uh, some kickoff goals and minor things going wrong off the kickoff. Anyways, we got a little 50 from Monkey. It looks like we're going to have some gameplay after this. Teammate can probably follow up if he's there, which he fakes. Good fake, actually. But you can just tell this is like a lower quality ranked lobby than compared to what we just watched. Uh, 10 seconds in, I don't know. I feel like the pros know how to follow up like a little bit quicker. Um, yeah, I guess that's like the only thing I would say about it. But uh, yeah, even teammate going for that right there seemed a little suspect. Monkey maybe not too happy with that. I felt like that was like monkey's ball. It looked like it was right in front of him and he could just keep going with it. And teammate trying to like cut and get the B, but it's just like he should just be behind monkey right there and just let him do his thing. Get the back left corner if, if that's a real boost. I think it is. I don't think it's a replay bug uh yeah it's definitely a real boost so yeah definitely just bad play right there already um simple things like that is what makes the difference between a high rated like 2300 elo 2s lobby compared to like this is probably if i had to guess it's probably like 2000 to 2100 so something is like as much as a 200 elo difference can make like you really see just the littlest mistakes pop out and they haven't been that big it's one two only which isn't uh you know huge it's just the littlest mistakes do the, the biggest things great great dribble from uh, teammate though it's gonna give monkey a lot of time to get this double tap he actually doesn't get it to go the shot was really slow not well placed either it, it could have been that slow if it was placed a little better or if he just shot a little faster he probably could have shot it right at him but he didn't either uh oh i like this from monkey moon though instead of rotating back he sees teammate has possession and he just starts going for demos really good play out of him phaeton just gonna keep a scrappy he's like all right i'm out of here see how monkey handles this waits for uh t7 to give it away then we're gonna call him t7 because i don't know how you say his name if there is a way to say his name i know what like all the middle eastern names like rawass rw9 i'm pretty sure oh look at that play real quick real quick look at this play the midfield pass back to monkey and then monkey just shoots it right at net and the defenders are just freaking out and yeah, all Monkey really had to do had to do was like flip into that, put it on net, and that, that was it. Um, well played from the blue team, and that's a kickoff goal. My lord, twos has got to be a tilting game mode because it is kickoff after kickoff, kind of like ones. Anywho, Middle Eastern names, I don't really know how to say it. Like so many uh, Middle Eastern players use numbers in their names, and I believe like you're supposed to be able to pronounce it. So... I, I don't know. Someone's going to have to check that for me or something. I just remember watching like a Johnny Boy stream, him saying something about it. And that's why everyone has like every Middle e majority of Middle Eastern players like have numbers in their names compared to like other regions. It's funny because Feenster has a number in his name and that doesn't mean shit except, I don't know. It's a gamer tag, bro. Look at look at uh look at the other team though. They're wearing the double French Phoenix. They look pretty intimidating. Monkey in this default octane. Teammate, I didn't really see what he was in. I think he's in a Fennec. Maybe he isn't an octane. I don't know. Monkey though, not touching his boost at all. Gets it over one. Bumps the last. Teammate doing a great job playing uh patiently. And yes, he is in the Fennec. Um for what it's worth. I don't know. Just kinda interesting to see what people drive and people wear these days see how monkey plays this he just air dribbles it over 150s teammate makes it very awkward teammate gonna keep going question mark he pops it over to monkey but monkey's at zero boost he's waiting waiting look at the patience right left not the greatest pass from teammate but you know the the division's the, the there i'm liking how the blue team is playing right now monkey just gonna shoot this on net surely it's not in it is not Easy save for uh, Rico, but Monkey with a testing shot for sure. Monkey going up for the block. He would have had the block, I believe, but it was definitely an awkward one. He, he seemed to get in front of it well. Phaeton with the flip reset. Monkey fakes. I love it. Don't force the uh, 50 or anything if you don't need to. 
And yeah, three two. The game keeps on going. Let's see what Phaeton has here. Monkey Moon gonna go up quick. Shot on net, and that's just in. What? And that's it. That is it. I I don't believe it. He's he's the best player to touch this game. I know the dick riding is insane right now, but like, come on, bro. He makes it too easy. So Phaeton just hits it up, and I'm watching a uh, T7 right now, and he flips right here. And yeah, that's just that, I guess. Rico is not able to get back. The shot is too powerful, and he knows it. I can't believe Monkey was just able to shoot that for free. And uh, I, I don't know what, oh, I'm on the fly cam, that's why. But yeah, Monkey was literally just able to double jump, shoot, and it's in. Knowing my ass, I would like air dribble it or just try and keep it close and then 50 something. But yeah, he just shot it. Good for him. That's why he's a pro player, ladies and gents, because he has the IQ of a mastermind. Uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this one. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what pro you want to watch next. And let me know if you want to see ones, twos, or threes, or a pro game, or anything. I'll watch whatever you guys want me to. I just like watching uh, Rocket League because it's a cool game. Cool eSport. All right, love y'all. Peace.